It's your boy Zay. We back with another video. Um, like I said, I wanted to say thank y'all to all the people who subscribing, who's showing love. You know what I'm saying? It just really means a lot to me that y'all can give me feedback. You know what I'm saying? Positive vibes, people in the comments. You know what I'm saying? Hey, this is a nice video. You know what I'm saying? Keep doing your thing. Appreciate that, man. That goes a long way. That just makes me have the urge to keep creating more content for y'all, man. But uh, yeah, I just want to appreciate all y'all. Um, the next giveaway, I told y'all the 50 subscriber giveaway passed. So the next giveaway that we're gonna do is gonna be at 250 subscribers. So, you know what I'm saying? I don't ask y'all to subscribe. I told y'all that's on y'all free will to do that. But when we do get there, just know it's gonna be a bigger cash amount than it was this last giveaway. Cause y'all, I was gonna make it to 150, but y'all just getting there like that. You know what I'm saying? I didn't expect y'all to keep subscribing to me like that. So um, we gonna put you to 250, and then you know 500. You know we gonna go up the charts. But you know what I'm saying? We gonna we gonna hop into this video. I'm basically finna break down. Two thousand years later. Some signs that you're merging with your higher self. You're starting to live off who you actually are and not the ego. You know what I'm saying? I got a video about this too as well, addressing the ego versus the higher self. So y'all gonna make sure y'all go scroll down. It's like one, it's like a little old video. So y'all make sure y'all go scroll down and go watch that video before you watch this one. So you can kind of understand the difference between the higher self and the ego. You know what I'm saying? That way you can know if you resonating with this video and how to you know what i'm saying that your higher self is merging the first thing that you want to experience when you merging with your higher self is that your life purpose you know what i'm saying you're going to start to find your life purpose god going to start to put things in your life that aligns you with your life purpose things that resonate with your actual true soul you know what i'm saying like you start to find things that you are here to do like you're not you're not looking at the distractions you're not trying to see what everyone else is doing you focused on your life purpose uh you just meant to connect with your higher self you meant to experience a life that other people will not be experiencing at that moment you your life purpose is here is is, is something here that you know what i'm saying that you're here to do and here to be called on earth to do whether it's like i said be a mentor be a leader be a teacher you know what I'm saying? Anything, mainly humanitarian, you know what I'm saying? That's the first sign that, you know what I'm saying? You're just going to start following your life purpose. You're going to just start following the thing that God actually sent you down here for. Because like I said, you was connecting um, with a side of you that is ultimately like finding who you truly are. You know what I'm saying? The higher self is you being the real you like actually not me like me looking at you right now i'm talking about the higher self like the inside you got to tap in to the inside you got to tap into that third eye you got to tap into that intuition to get to that point a lot of people don't operate off the higher self they operate off the ego go watch that video you know what i'm saying but you know what i'm saying the other sign is that you know you no longer force things you don't feel the need to force things anymore because you just you live into your high potential you live in to your higher purpose, your higher self, you know what I'm saying? You don't feel the force things anymore. You start to live in the present moment. A lot of people live in the past, you know what I'm saying? People wake up and live in the past like, oh, I couldn't accomplish this yesterday and I couldn't do this and I couldn't do that, stop. When you start to merge with your higher self, you're gonna understand that you're gonna start creating your life purpose. You're gonna start understanding what God has for you for your life purpose. You understand that, you know what I'm saying? You're not gonna force things anymore. You know what I'm saying? If things aren't meant to be what they are, you don't chase them. You don't, you know what I'm saying? And I got another video coming about that soon, so just stay tuned. But you just don't follow what other people are doing. You don't chase. You just let things happen for what happens because you understand that God is leads you on a bigger, bigger objective. So you're you don't feel free to, you know what I'm saying, live in the past. You focus on the present only. How can how can I evolve my soul? How can I evolve the person that I was yesterday to today? You're always looking to improve yourself. You know what I'm saying? You never you never go back to your past to try to improve yourself. 
you, you cancel that out oh that was yesterday okay let me cancel that out let me try to fix what this is today but how can i be a better person today how can i achieve my goals how can i get even closer this even if it's one step closer how can i get closer you know what i'm saying that's just another sign that you're going to experience when you are merging with your higher self the other sign is that you find peace within yourself you know what i'm saying you find authentic peace in between yourself you know what i'm saying you let go of self you let go of self-doubt you know what i'm saying self-criticism everything that was holding you back you don't pertain and you don't hold on to that no more you know what i'm saying because you understand that you vibrate you gotta you gotta be vibrating at a high vibration to connect with your higher self a lot of people don't connect with their higher self a lot of people are ran by ego a lot of people are ran by just materialistic stuff. Oh, I need this, I need that. Things that don't fulfill them. When you wish your higher self, you understand the real goals in life, the real needs, the real things you have to do to succeed. You know what I'm saying? You're going to have to find that peace within yourself. You know what I'm saying? You got to understand, you're going to be the only person you're going to die with. You're going to be the only person that you're going to have to meet goals with. You're the only person that's going to have to get to those goals and put in that work. Ain't nobody going to be there for you. They're going to be there for you, but they ain't going to be there for you. You know what I'm saying? Like, you're going to have to learn how to find peace within yourself. You're going to have to learn how to just accept things for what it is. You know what I'm saying? Can't live for other people. You know what I'm saying? You just got to be authentic to yourself. Another sign is that, you know what I'm saying, you just stop following trends. Stop following what other people doing. He's, he did that, she did that. Uh, no, who cares, bro? Because when you start living with that real self, you start living with that higher self, you know what I'm saying? You start living so authentically to a point where you don't, you, it hurts you to follow other people, other trends, you know what I'm saying? You got to start, you know what I'm saying? Stop following trends like, oh, he did that, you know what I'm saying? Oh. Uh, you do that dance and TikTok dance and all this. Stop following trends. Stop following what's popular. You you not here to replicate what everyone else is doing. You here so you can find your true purpose. You here so you can understand that there's a bigger meaning in life. Stop falling into those distractions. Stop following the trends. Stop following. Hey, bro, let's do this. Let's do that. No, stop. Don't be a follower. You're not a follower. You a leader. You know what I'm saying? This is what you do. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you start to tap into your higher yourself. Going back to the first reason, your life purpose. You know what I'm saying? You're going to start to understand who you really are. If you're a mentor, if you're a teacher. You don't got time to follow trends. You're not a follower. You're a leader. You're supposed to shine your light to the people and lead them. You're not supposed to follow the people that low vibrational. <laughs> How they, where they do that at? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So you just start to um, find the good. You also understand that you're going to come across some good and bad experience in your life. And you're okay with that. You, you're completely okay because you understand at a certain level of your heart. So that you are not everything is going to be perfect. Everything that you come across is not going to flow like water. You know what I'm saying? It could be sunshine and rainbows. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be some rainy days, it's going to be some storms, you know what I'm saying? But you understand that even me going through these challenging phase, phases of my life, it's still going to help me ascend, you know what I'm saying? Most people, you know what I'm saying, when they face a hard challenge, they give up. But when you start merging with your higher stuff, you understand that there is a deeper meaning and that there is a bigger accomplishment above. You're actually grateful that you're going through the hard time, that way you can... Oh, this is what God's trying to show me, so I don't have to replicate that again. If he shows me one time, then maybe I don't have to keep doing it two, three, four, or five times. Why? Because I learned. I know what to look for. You know what I'm saying? That's that's that's, that's just another sign. You just stop. You know what I'm saying? You stop following trends, and you understand that life has its ups and its downs, has good and bad experiences. I, like I be always telling y'all, man, nothing is permanent. You know what I'm saying? Even good and and in bad situations they're temporary you know what i'm saying you learn and you evolve no matter if you're rich or whatever you're still gonna have good and bad days it don't matter what type of success you get i want to get that out your head no matter what type of success you get 
We're always gonna run through good and bad problems. That's just the way it is. That's the way life is. Cause we always are looking to evolve. Your higher self is looking to evolve. The ego wants to stay comfortable and it doesn't want to grow. Like I told you, I could watch that video. But you know what I'm saying? The higher self, when you start merging with your higher self, you just start to be more authentic. You know what I'm saying? Another sign is, is that you see life beyond the reality for what it is. You know what I'm saying? Like, you just start to see everything for what it is. You start to see that things that you frequent that you used to do before, you don't do no more. Why? Because that didn't line with your higher self back then. You start to come now where you got a higher peace. You got a, you got a higher, what is that word? You got a, just a higher standpoint for yourself. You know what I'm saying? You don't get distracted by, oh, what other people are doing or what they want you to do. Because you're living so authentically now. That you know what you did before wasn't authentically. So it's like, I'm pushing towards to be who I actually am. You know what I'm saying? You start to be see, you start to see beyond what people are not doing that you are doing. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people just be distracted. A lot of people just be comfortable. On, on your hand, you're trying to evolve. You're trying to grow. You're trying to learn. No matter if you got to go through the bad experiences or not, you're just trying to ascend. You know what I'm saying? Those other people are just trying to stay stagnant in the same position. When you start to see things beyond reality, you understand that everything, everything is a deeper mission. Everything that they told us was a lie. You know what I'm saying? You start to say, "Hold on, uh, let me let me take a break. Let me just look around the world and see what the hell is going on, bro. Like, why are we living in a place where you know what I'm saying?" We got to pay for water. We got to pay for food. You just start to analyze shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, who are we? You know what I'm saying? But you know who you are. You know what I'm saying? When you, when you start connecting with that higher self, it starts to show you parts of yourself that you were ignoring. You know what I'm saying? And your, your true fulfillment in life. Your real you. You know what I'm saying? Another is the last sign we're going to get into is that you, you don't care to be authentic for real. Like... When someone comes up to you, you you don't sugarcoat nothing. You're not being around the bush. You know what I'm saying? You're telling people how it is. It's not being unkind. It's actually being kind. You know what I'm saying? Being too realistic in this life now, people are so soft, bro. Being too realistic now in this life, people, oh, you being too mean to me. <laughs> what? I'm trying to tell you. I'm trying to help you. No, being too being too realistic in this lifetime, in this society, in this day and age, is being mean. You can't you can't be realistic no more. You know what I'm saying? But you just start you, you just don't sugarcoat things. You start to live authentically for you because you understand. You know that that gives off a good vibration for you. You know that you're living in your purpose when you're doing that. You you don't feel the need to try to blend in with society. You don't feel the need. You don't care if people look at you different. Why? Because you're living authentically. You know what I'm saying? You doing what God told you to do. You're not learning, oh, I'm not gonna wear those shoes or I'm not gonna do that because they don't like them or maybe they gonna look at me crazy. Who cares, bro? Like, who literally cares at all? Cause really, people see you, but they don't really care, bro. People just you you come you know how many people you go across every day, and even you stay in the house. You know what I'm saying? Someday you're gonna go across some people. You was never finna see them people again. You know what I'm saying? Stop caring what other people think of you. You know what I'm saying? Those are the signs, man. If some of those signs resonated with you, man, let me know in the comment section and everything. You know, but you know what I'm saying? I want to give off some words of wisdom. I got to tell y'all. Practice gratitude because you are here right now. You are literally watching my video. Like, think about that, y'all. You woke up today. You got fresh water to drink. You got people to text. People that care about you, people that can call you, hey, what's good, you good? Yeah, yeah, straight. You got a job. If you don't got a job, God's gonna bless you with a job if you're holding faith. You gotta have faith. You got a bed, you got a home. You know what I'm saying? There's so much things to be grateful for. The fact that you can breathe, the fact that you can talk, the fact that your fingers work to click this video. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Start being grateful. Because the more grateful you are, the more the universe says, okay, 
Now he's ready for the next phase. He, he, he got over the materialism phase. He got over this. He's starting accepting life for what it is. So now we're going to bless him. Because once you stop, ah, I can't, I can't say that because I'm going to dive deeper into another video with that. But, um, make sure, um, make sure y'all give me y'all feedback. Um, like I said, if y'all ever going through some stuff and everything, feel free to text me on my socials in the description down below, man. I'm here for y'all, man. I'm an old soul. I understand from a high level. I'm really wise. I'm really mature for my age. You know what I'm saying? So I do know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying? I'm not just telling y'all. No book, no BS, you know what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all the real spill, real deal knowledge, you know what I'm saying? So, if y'all ever feel free, um, if y'all ever want to contact me, if you're going through some stuff and everything, you just want some simple motivation, hit my freaking socials in the link in the description. You know what I'm saying? Um, follow me on my socials if you want to. Like I said, I'm gonna beg out for style, I'm gonna beg out of follow my stuff. Y'all do things like your free will. But it's your boy Zay, man. And I'm gonna go ahead and get up out of here, man. I gotta go work soon, man. I love y'all, man. Y'all all stay safe, stay positive. That's the way to life. And uh, I'll see y'all in the next video.